Uh, we're well, three at the back, three in the middle. Woman on. Well done, love this one. There are all these ideas thrown out, like the larks, all these really lame names. The word warrior, I think of a fighter. I think of someone that doesn't give up. Strength, courage, teamwork. I prefer it to the word woman. It's more competitive, more about support, and more about winning. Somebody who's about to battle, who's about to, you know, just go out there and fight and win. Warriors shows we like mean what we're going in to achieve. Um, I think it's a good name. My name's Sana and I'm the club captain at FBB Warriors. We run a weekly session for women to play football. We train every Wednesday nights in South London and since 2013 we've had around 50 women join us and a lot of those have been playing for the first time. I think it's really important to make sure that people kind of feel engaged and they don't feel that they're not good enough or that they're too good but just encourage people and foster like a collective spirit. I'd never played any football before I joined. At the beginning we, we were playing in this youth centre and like balls were like bouncing off the walls and the ceiling. Um, it was a mess. And now we're getting some like really clean passes, some like really, really nice bits of football. I've always loved to play, so I've just started to play again and I love playing football. Football's the only time that everything else melts away from me, so it's a time where I just focus on one thing, and it's football. I really enjoy going to the Warriors training because everybody is dedicated to what they do. Everyone's on different levels, but everyone is willing to try. I've just always wanted to know how good I can be, so I've never really stuck to it. Um, so because I love it so much, I keep coming back. I'm extremely competitive, um, extremely. We compete on every little thing, to be honest. It's unnatural, to be honest with you, how much we compete. The one thing I say that we shouldn't play together is FIFA. We have controls being thrown at each other, we have games being turned off. But I think it's healthy competition. I think it's good to be a little bit competitive. There's a point of playing football in the back garden, and then there's a point of being the first girl to play football at your school, which is kind of a bit of a situation which isn't really supported by the great community. I think I'm quite aggressive when I play football because I grew up playing with boys. I kind of had to be, it was survival. I was sure and I was a girl, so it was really important. I made sure they knew I was there, and so the best way to do that was to be aggressive. When I used to play in school, I was quite shy and reserved, but as I grew older and played with older women and just being a bit arrogant, because football you have to be a bit cocky and have a bit of bravado, it brings you out of your shell, it forces you out of your shell. I want to play more. At the end of a session, I always want to play more. I'm never completely exhausted from football. One of the great things about it is it still has room for individual brilliance. So it's still it's about kind of harnessing the power of everyone whilst also encouraging people to um, like individually express themselves. Depending on how good or bad my performances, I may feel a little bit angry or you know just a bit beat myself up. But most of the times, I feel pretty good. Because we've got to know each other as people, we've also at the same time got to know each other as footballers. So you kind of learn to read people on and off the pitch. It makes me feel like um, this, you know, some some sort of sense of achievement. It makes me feel like I can 
do, you know, I can play football and I can become what I want to become.